What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Kaguya sama. Love is war. Feels absolutely great saying that. Now, before we get into anything, I got two things I want to tell you real quick about this video. The first thing is I got a lot of recommendations from you guys to watch the teaser trailer video because they adapted an entire chapter about it, so similar to how they'll have the three episode style things in a singular episode, three stories. This is just one of those stories. So I am including this. I am including this in the video. I don't know how much I'm going to need to edit this if I can make time. You know, there's a lot of things about that. I don't know. But the second thing about this video, I'm sure some of you guys are aware. Some of you aren't. When it comes to the shows that I react to on the channel, the full the first and last episode of every season of every show that is on the channel, the full length version, which is normally a Patreon exclusive, is available for free for everyone. So click the link in the top of the description. Enjoy that free full length. Come back here for the review when you're done and if you do enjoy that consider checking out that patreon to keep that for all the rest of the episodes and all the other shows um other than that i'm very excited last episode i think was my favorite of all kaguya episodes 11 and 12 the little bunch but i've heard nothing but absolutely great things to be honest this is the highest rated anime season of all time on uh my anime list it even beat the goat itself full metal alchemist so we shall see what that means like I said, don't forget to check out that Patreon, like, leave a comment down below so I know exactly how you're feeling. Don't forget to subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Um, but we're getting into this teaser trailer first, and then we're getting right into episode one and then two of season three. Let's do it. Gotta get some Shonen Jump. Why do we need to do a bag check? We're still on hiatus talking about their favorite manga okay is that like an actual ploy or is that like an actual <laughs> social commentary on what like who togashi shouts out to ishigami and miyuki i only know what i know now i said social commentary about togashi i'm sure there's a lot of mangaka who deal with illness and are unable to produce their the craft after that but maybe this is a social commentary on the kaguya <laughs> mangaka because like after see after two seasons there's finally a third season in the season three teaser trailer you know you could tell he started slowly just getting over there and then he started peeking over and now he's just full-on sit with them now they're like leaning over on each other and now he couldn't get it this time and now miyuki's heartbroken oh takudam Okay, this has to be social commentary. This is so funny. I hear people talk about this in certain animes to this day. But lo and behold. Yeah, I've been there. That is true. Let's refer to our otaku senpai. No, you're thrilled. You're just trying to hide a little bit of your eagerness, you know? He's like Brutus in the staffing of Julius Caesar. Such a dirty guy. You are so dirty for that one, Ishigami. <laughs> forgive me he's a closet otaku okay me in high school me in middle school and high school 100 percent. i have never actually brought manga to school though but i have definitely uh-huh <laughs> i know it's so funny i know exactly what this feels like it took so long for people to know I was super into anime. And now that it's socially acceptable, I just flash it everywhere. And that, and I don't give a shit what anyone thinks, but like, at the crossroads, look at the way they animated this. It's so funny. Kawaii. 
I love the way they animated this. That POV shot of him running on that. Okay. Ask us some of your questions. The social commentary is so real. I love it. Oh, she is painting the wrong picture. Ujiwara. Chika, chika, chika. The fact that I've fallen in love with anime characters before, I'm just like... Hey, I'm not one of those creepy people either, right? Maybe I am, I don't know. Now he's heartbroken. You're a kind-hearted liar. <laughs> now he's... And now he's stuck between a rock and a hard place. Jesus Christ. Ooh, Ghibli movies are 1 million percent anime. I haven't heard of that one. Yeah, I know. Everyone's in Osaka. <laughs> Listen, how serious. For like a trailer, a teaser into season three, like this will get me so much back in those Kaguya vibes, you know, the mood. Hooray <laughs> for anime adaptation. I cannot get over the social commentary in this episode, the fourth meta wall breaking, all that. I love this, bro. This is probably even a reference to something that I'm not even picking up. Congrats on season... Is this the school? I love the title. I love the way everything is happening like that. That was so good, honestly. For a teaser trailer, that was really well done. All right, that was amazing. Now it's time for actual season three. The I don't think I was about to say the final season, but I'm about to be caught up. It's not the final season. Oh, I'm so upset. I'm about to be caught up. Oh, uh, yep. Yeah. Right where last season ended. I wanted them to play the opening song again. I want to say real quick. I didn't I didn't talk about this for a while only because it just came to me. But uh, I, friend, I need to get his name down. Shouts out to the guy who DM'd me on Patreon telling me not only about some of the anime references, but like the Bake Monogatari specific reference that they literally almost did shot for shot. Like I love the commentary and the anime references in the show. I love it so much. You guys need to let me know all of them that come up. The school literally just, and then came right back down. <laughs> That's so funny. That's hilarious. There's been some hilarious videos I've seen. Obviously, they're pranking people, thinking, but no, that's a real thing. So we're just going to sit back and enjoy the ambient sounds. I do like how they animate it. It's just like you're in the office in the forest, you know? Now we're at a construction site? How is that soothing at all? She has like a praise kink. <laughs> she loves being praised. A therapist soothing voice like vent. I don't I don't know. <laughs> Moral support from heartthrob CD volume three. <laughs> Yours. <laughs> Some light healing music, I see. It's pretty heavy. Ishigami's actually looking out for her by doing that. Shouts out to him. But then if he reveals that if he reveals that data that she has it accidentally unplugged, he would admit that he knew the entire time. He's gonna 
even though they beef all the time i love the way they were constantly like on the low looking out for each other ishigami and ino like she was voting for him in the race you know he was helping her with the election and he's embarrassing himself look at this that's not ishigami oh yeah if you if you see someone in the vicinity go through this you're gonna always double check your I mean, shouts out Ishigami, the man who doesn't need to be thanked for the things he does. A better man than me. As if nothing happened. Oh, yeah. It would be so awkward. Oh, that was hilarious. Shouts out to the goat, Ishigami. Doing what he has to do, and he still couldn't save her. Have you gotten hang of your smartphone yet? How should I reply? He does. Yep, invalidates one of the greatest excuses in all of the texting language. He's in a state of slight frenzy. If you get left on red, you're pretty upset. Oh, he double texted? An instant red res- <laughs> Oh my, I know we've all been there, whether it's Snapchat or texting or Discord DMs, to where we're going to send someone a DM or or, or we see we get a message and we go into it and they're still typing, they're still- You're like, oh, give me, let me get out of there immediately. Because being seen as you're like, looking over like it's like you're like what the why does man look like like you don't got nothing better to do like, it's like, it's so funny look at her face ayasaka knows the true details of what's going on oh yeah Oh, smart ass Miyuki. Yeah, yep. There's ways to get around it. I I know so many people on Snapchat that will literally like. There's ways to not show that you read it. You know. That's. <laughs> Please don't leave me on red. Leave on read. What is leave on red? What does that mean? He called to avoid that red receipt. Smart. I love her. <laughs> Look at eyes. I think you got her on this one, Miyuki. What's this play from Hayasaka? <laughs> That's one of those one-off excuses that really work for Kaguya, you know? Her family's crazy. Look at her look, bro. She looks evil. And he is heartbroken. Everyone's being left on red. I have a lot of friends who hate being left on red. <laughs> That's me. But Discord, Discord's pretty cool. Just, everyone's like, who gives a fuck? <laughs> the heck? Whoa, that's me. My arms get tired. It's called sexism. How does she say it so calm, cool, and collected like that? I feel like Chica's really ripped. He was a jock type in junior high. Okay, both of them like the hidden sleepers of fitness. Let's do this. An arm wrestling tournament. We need a hierarchy. We need to know our position on the arm wrestling scales. 
Haku, you got Ishigami. I was like, what's going on? I was so confused for a second. Oh, I do remember she's an archery club. And I know certain bows, especially long bows, the, dr the drawback is so strong. Wow. Shout out to Kaguya. Oh my god. I love these like verses here. This is so funny. Okay, Super Saiyan. Really? Shouts out Kaguya for the observations, but she's only doing this because she wants to hold hands with <laughs> Miyuki as well. Yeah, yeah, I'm weak. Well, you're a cheater, huh? <laughs> What was that? It's an arm wrestle battle in the heavens. <laughs> she just wanted to keep that position as long as possible. They're sitting there for like two hours. Oh, she's just calming herself every. Okay. That's what she's doing. <laughs> she said, You are not feeling a sweaty hand of mine. That's that's mean, Chica. That's a good one. Our whole world is crashing down. Kaguya wins, but also Kaguya loses. That's so funny. <laughs> I think this is going to be the opening, but I don't want to listen to it because of the credits right here. Maybe I should wait till next episode to listen to it. So I avoid the credits. Oh, I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to listen to it next episode. We're watching one more right now, you know? All right, on to episode two. Now it's starting with the opening. So I'm about to react to the opening for the first time. I skipped it last episode so I can get the full visuals and non-credits. So hopefully I enjoy this opening. I've heard great things. Let's do this. It sounds like the same band. Is it the same band that sings all the Kagi openings? Because I love them. Oh my girl. Oh, I love the colors. Ayasaka, Ino, Ishigami, Chika. Oh my god. I love these visuals. Look, everyone. <laughs> oh, Kagi openings do not miss at all. Literally, Ishigami is her behind the scenes fixer. <laughs> so they both do behind the scenes help for each other. Yeah. 
Yeah, so they're both like that with each other. They both really help each other and like each other, but they hate each other. <laughs> I like the way they jump back as if they're like warriors in a battle. I still don't even think I have Eno's friend's name. Okay, friendship plan. Compliment each other? Not bad. Like this aura of pinkness around her, you know. All right, now name some good qualities about Ishigami. Let's go, you know. Wow. Ear cleaning. This is the way they decided to do it. E <laughs> and not what I was envisioning either. This is what I've been saying. Okay, robots. This is actually what I assume, though, that they hate each other so much that they love each other. Osaragi, is that her name? Wait, what did she just say? I can draw something even... Yeah, whoa. Okay, shouts out to my boy Miyuki. Having some plans, doing some extracurriculars. Shouts out to Kaguya. W Queen right there. What would make you say that? What is this background? Perfect plan, send Hayasaka. Let's drink, sing, and cut loose, everyone. I've never been to karaoke or done karaoke, but I would want to do it someday. You got to get me a little drunk, though. If I get a little tipsy, I'll start dancing, singing. It's like it's not even funny. When she talks about him dumping her, are they talking about that library episode where she was like pretending to be interested in him? I mean, it's a good ploy. Get him guilty, so get out of here. Uh oh, what is she gonna sing? My feelings. My sing out my feelings. Okay, first off, the song choice horrible for for what's going on in Miyuki's head right now. Second off, Hayasaka is hitting those notes. I know, I would leave immediately. Immediately. As she's on like a rooftop spying, what the hell? Yes, yes, indeed. I feel like this might actually be Ayasaka talking, like legitly her. She always puts on this some sort of like, not like a mask or a front, but she always puts on this professionalism, you know? Shouts out to my boy Miyuki. Is genuinely about to leave, 
but had to save her, you know. Now, is she... Uh-huh. Is she going for her own agenda, though, just to prove Kaguya right? Or is she... Shouts out, Miss Hayasaka, looking mighty, mighty beautiful tonight. Drama among the minor characters. Oh, these two guys. Oh, no. Okay. That's the one. This is quite the predicament. What is Kaguya gonna do? I really don't think Hayasaka <laughs> is fucking Miyuki in there, but yeah. <laughs> Look at Chika in her little nightgown. You know, Chika doesn't care about anything. She'll, she'll walk right in. Even if she knew Hayasaka and Miyuki was in there, she would still walk right in. She just doesn't care. Based off this, I think Hayasaka is venting. Let me show you the... He said, don't pull it out, it'll destroy me. <laughs> like, what kind of verbiage? His voice. Okay, that's what I'm like. I'm like, okay. Oh, Chica knows. Chica tried to teach him. She also has me. <laughs> what kind of... <laughs> Look, she's like, okay, well, I'll go home too. Yep. They have such a good but interesting but weird relationship. Hayasaka and Kaguya. I can see that more or less like sisters. I like that. It's not because you're rapping, I swear. Damn. No. God damn. All right, first time hearing this ending. Let's do it. What kind of isekai style Mushoku Tensei animated... Kaguya is this. <laughs> this has to be some sort of original, creative, stylized op ending. Because, like, this is, like, 86. This is, like, a whole bunch of other shows. It's, like, Neon Genesis. What the fuck is this? This is super creative. <laughs> I need more endings like this. I really do. I wonder specifically what that's a reference to. If you guys have, like, an idea, let me know. Because I love that. That was really cool. All right, I am unbelievably ready for this season. Oh, it's it's got me. I got goosebumps. I'm right into those Kaguya vibes, you know. I love that teaser trailer uh, with Ishigami. I love that first episode, Ishigami and Ino and their disdain and the hen. Uh -huh. I never, I didn't, I never ended up getting her name. So if you guys could tell me, I, I'd appreciate it. Ino's friend, who's been there from the beginning. Ino, uh, Ino's friend and Miyuki trying to get them to get along. So funny. And then you had this episode. Um, karaoke, networking, all that. Chica just being hilarious as always. I love the social commentary in that teaser trailer. I was talking about getting a third season. Talking about anime characters with big tits and high-pitched voices with accessories in their hair. So funny. I love this show because it takes itself seriously. But it takes itself so not seriously so much that it makes the perfect parody satire but still super emotional super heartwarming and it's so great the music and the animation phenomenal i love the opening i'm gonna have my own uh reaction to all the openings and all the endings so look out for that other than that hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did please leave a like let me know your thoughts down below don't forget to subscribe click that bell all that jazz check out that patreon don't forget to drink some water tell someone you love them have a great day dapper squad peace out